In health news, BCIT has swept the awards this year in an annual competition aimed at making life a little easier for people with ALS. The team won all four categories with mind-boggling inventions, such as glasses that enable a patient to operate their computer with the blink of an eye. Brian Coxford has the details. He never thought he'd be coming back to school this way. A former auto mechanic who's used to mobility, now wheelchair bound, fighting a terminal disorder that has left him a prisoner in his own body. The thing that you miss the most when you have, some, like ALS for instance, is just the simple little things. I can just sit this over here and I can use this. It's those simple things, the tasks we all take for granted in everyday life, that these gifted BCIT students want Alan Jansen to be able to experience again. Oops, that says... And that's why they went to him, hoping to use their biomedical engineering skills to make life better for him. I want the students to focus on the client and not on the technology. We've all seen the walks to raise awareness for ALS, better known as Lou Gehrig's disease. There are close to 2,000 in Canada, about 300 in BC who have the cruel neurological disease. Life expectancy is three to five years. And as it progresses, it claims all body functions, leaving the thinking brain intact. The fact that the BCIT students care about them is a very big deal for Al. The stuff they've, they've come up with is to, to make our lives better, to make us feel useful. With just the touch of a finger. At BCIT, um, the second year the students have and, uh, developed portable devices that allow an ALS patient to send a text or make a cell call with a simple touch. I require immediate assistance and a machine that will turn on the lights, a TV, play music, and even open doors. All activated through a headband when Elle moves his eyebrows up and down. We're very proud of our project and our device, and being able to work with Alan is a great experience. This is the CCD. BCIT yep. students won the top four awards for ALS technology inventions, knocking off all their counterparts in UBC, UVic, and SFU. The top prize going to an innovative pair of glasses with a camera attached called iSelect. So this is something a person could use, like, right, even when they're totally incapacitated, can't move at all. iSelect allows patients like Alan to operate a computer, surf the net, play games. They can operate the mouse with the back and forth movement of their eyes. I guess I was fiercely independent all my life, and this just is keeping some of that there. You know, get you back there. It's incredible. I mean, there's a lot of people going to benefit for a long, long time out of this. The BCIT students not only have bragging rights over the competition at other biomedical engineering schools, they built iSelect for the cost of materials, $150. The brain power that went into creating it is worth a whole lot more. Congratulations to them.